Are we high fiving for excitement? Um, did we do it? I don't know if we did it. Okay, let's do one more super double high five. <laughs> let's see if that worked or not. So let me just share um, my screen with you, and I'm going to show you two discussion board pieces that I put together. But essentially, this is a post-reading activity where they'll get a chance to collaboratively process um, the text, create things, do something with it, take the information and turn it into something new, um, and support each other while they do that. And hope so I want to actually talk more about asynchronous teaching, which I think is a really good um, contrast to some of the things we've been talking about so far. I'm Professor Seeger. I'm going to be teaching you botany this semester. I've been teaching botany and natural history at Mesa College for almost 20 years, but I've never taught in my front yard before. So this should be kind of fun. Hi, welcome to Nutrition 150. I'm Carrie Johnson and I'll be your instructor. Good evening. I'm Professor Chuck Ambers and I'm here at the African Diaspora Museum and Research Center that I created some 22 years ago with my friend, Team Tutankhamen, and we will share a little history about who I am and how I got here. I want this class to be a safe place for you, that you feel free to explore, to learn, to make mistakes, to make adjust, adjustments, and uh, sort of like what I'm doing at this very moment, making this first video for you. Hey everybody, how you doing? Uh, my name is Nate Betchart, and I will be your ceramics teacher this semester. Um, Kind of a weird semester, um, but I think it's going to work out, and I'll get into that in a second. Um, One thing I've learned from the Build with Mesa Buddies program is how to be more comfortable with Canvas and working towards a remote teaching uh, environment with my class. Although the remote classroom environment is still pretty foggy to me, uh, it's starting to clear up. A huge takeaway is the fact that there are so many options, that there's not just one way to do things. It was fantastic getting a chance to see how other people are structuring their course. Um, it was great to connect with people who teach similar courses as well as those who teach very different courses, but to see how they decided to set up um, their Canvas course. And I'm definitely going to be doing more videos um, this next semester. I think it was really nice how um, Katie and Cara did so many videos. It was really just a warm and friendly um, interaction with them. And I, I like how it made me feel as a student. So I want to continue to do that as a professor as well. And again, I'm refining it, but it's a, a quick assign a short assignment i mean an easy to understand assignment mm -hmm. and then here's a video which i think we'll play all right gang so let's go in for this uh oh you were able to do the split screen yeah, so like, i was spending my time learning how to do that kind of stuff there we are I think we're on the right page. Am I not, Donna? You are correct, sir. 
Thank you very much. I appreciate it. So everybody, here is my Fall 2020 Humanities 106 uh, homepage. 